By the end of this video, you're going to know which AI voice generation software is better for you. I'm going to compare Murph AI with 11 Labs, and I'm going to compare both of their monthly plans so you can decide which one is going to give you more value for money. So let's start off with Murph AI and see the different plans that they offer. So I'm currently on the free plan, which gives you basically nothing because you can't even download the voiceovers. It's basically just for testing. And then the cheapest one they have is the basic plan. So this one starts at 29 US dollars per month per user. And you know, these are the features that you get. You get unlimited downloads, you get 6G basic voices, 10 different languages that you can choose from, uh, two hours of voice generation, you get commercial rights, collaborative workspace, or 8,000 soundtracks, and you get chat and email support. So commercial usage just means that you can actually make money with the voices that you generate. Like if you create content on YouTube or if you're running an ad, then you can monetize that and actually make money from it. Now let's compare that to the free plan with 11 labs. So obviously you can't compare it because it's free, but it's still pretty good. You don't get the commercial license, which means you can't monetize it. But if you're doing like a school project or something, then this would work pretty well for that. You get 10,000 characters per month, which is enough for like, you know, like a short essay. And then you can create three custom voices. Now this is really, really interesting because I don't really know any other AI voice generation company that actually allows you to create a custom voice on their free plan. And this allows you to create three. In Murph AI, if you want to create a custom voice, pretty much the only way you can do it is by cloning a voice. And to do that, you actually have to contact their sales team. So this is a pretty big setback. You actually don't get anything in the free plan and you actually have to request it. Whereas with 11 labs, you automatically get to create up to three custom voices, which is awesome. Uh, and this is on their free plan, right? So that's actually insane. Now, let's compare their starter package, which starts at just $5 a month, but for your first month, you get 80% off, so it's a dollar a month. And here you get up to 30,000 characters per month, 10, 10 custom voices, insane. You get your commercial license, so now you can actually monetize this. You can also do voice cloning, which again, for voice cloning on Murphy AI, you actually have to submit a request. And you can use the dubbing studio as well, where you can dub your videos or you can dub in different languages, which is really, really cool. And this is just for $5 a month after the first month. Now let's compare this to the closest competitor for Murph's cheapest plan, right? Which this is $29 a month and with 11 labs is 22 bucks a month. Whereas the first month is going to be $11. Uh, it's going to be 50% off. Now here you get to create a hundred thousand characters per month. And this is the plan that I'm on, which is enough for two hours of audio, which is the same as with the Murph plan. But on top of that, you can create up to 30 custom voices, right? You can use professional voice cloning on, of your own voice, which is really cool. Again, you have to actually request that with Murph AI. And then you get to also get additional characters based on a small charge and uh, just a lot of really good features. So it's actually pretty good. If I was going to compare the creator plan with Murph's uh, basic plan, then 11 Lab honestly just blows out of the water. And having used both of them, I think the voices actually sound a lot nicer in 11 Labs as well. I just think it's better software. The voices just sound more accurate. And now if you look at the pro plan here, which is $39 a month, and you compare that to, uh, you know, I guess the next one here is independent publisher, which is just way more. But, you know, you get everything in creator. You get to create 500,000 characters, which is 10 hours of audio. Whereas with this one, you get four hours. So I guess you can't really compare, you can't really compare it beyond this point. The only thing you can really compare is, um, uh, the creator package with 11 labs versus the pro and the basic on Murphy AI, because after that, it becomes really custom. You get to independent publisher, growing business and enterprise. So for most of you guys, I would recommend actually getting started with 11 labs with their free plan, because it offers so many features. You can test it out. You can create custom voices. And then if you actually like it, you can get started with the starter package and just move on from there. But, you know, if you want to try it more AI as well, you can also do that. The links to both of them are in the description and you can try them both out completely for free. But in my opinion, if you want to talk about value and, you know, the quality of the voiceovers, as well as value for your money, like how much you're actually getting, 11 Labs is honestly just so far ahead of the competition. Murphy AI is not even close. But that's just my opinion. Links to both of them in the description. Thank you so much for watching.